Next paper is Anatomical Variations of the Renal Vasculature and its Association with the Outcome of Live Donor Nephrectomies. Authors are Laksiri W. Aruchelvam J. Paper will be presented by Dr. Laksiri, Medical Officer, Base Hospital, Horana. Good afternoon. Uh, the, uh, this presentation uh, is Anatomical Variations of the Renal Vasculature and its Association with the Outcome of Live Down and Nephrectomies. Renal artery variations occur in 18% to 21% of population and variations determine the site selection and the outcome. This series reports the renal vascular anatomy variations encountered during live donor nephrectomies. Here consecutive live donor nephrectomies done by single surgeon were included. Patient's demography, live down and nephrectomy side, and renal vascular arterial variations, complications were recorded. The kidney with worse function and least number of renal arteries of the donor were selected for live down and nephrectomy. The renal vascular anatomical uh, variations was also assessed during the surgery. Um, single renal artery and vein with hyalur division was considered normal anatomy. Incomplete records were excluded. These are results. Here finally 159 cases included. Out of them 103 were males and uh, mean age was 38.2 years and uh, 106 of them underwent left side live donor nephrectomy. Single renal artery, patients with single renal artery, uh, 136 cases. Of these, 34 had early branching. 23, which is 14.5%, had multiple renal arteries, uh, two in 21 and three in two cases. And therefore, variations occurred in 35.8%. Here we done a subgroup analysis of 123 renal vein variations. Single renal artery patients who were 6.8% had multiple veins. Multiple arteries or early branching arteries patients, 9 out of 35, had multiple veins. This difference was significant. And 11, 6.9% had complications whom 3 had hematoma. Two out of three hematoma patients had early branching of renal arteries and underwent right live donor nephrectomy. Conclusions are renal artery variations occur in 35.8%. Multiple arteries and early branch is associated with multiple veins. The complication rates in right live donor nephrectomy and patients with early branch appear to be high. However, this was not statistically significant, probably due to low numbers. Thank you. Please open for questions. How is information going to be helpful for the uh, learning sur surgical trainees and uh, the other surgical yeah. units? Yeah, because most of the as I previously said, uh, most patients who underwent live donor nephrectomy who were males and right side, we can emphasize there is risk, additional risk, uh, that post-operative period uh, get complicated because of hematoma and things. Yeah. And have you tried to correlate this with the uh, pu already published uh, figures in uh, like larger studies? Yeah, we, uh, we are looking uh, at future. We have to get more uh, data uh, for uh, be because here there is a small amount of data. We have to take more data analysis for that. Have you compared this with the international literature? Uh, 
according to international literature, they were said that there is a, a 18 to 21 percent of renal artery variations. Here we, uh, our final conclusion was uh, that there is a 35.8 percent variations were there. So that uh, international literature also says male on the right side. Yes, it? yes. So that is already a known fact. Yes, right side uh, donor nephrectomies, you have to uh, dissect more. Uh, deeply to uh, explore vessels. Yeah, so if it is a known fact, how will this particular study help? If you say it is already known, yes. can, how can this give a further information? Yeah. Um, uh, here, uh, right side donor nephrectomy. Uh, as a in vascular people, vascular surgeon, they are known factor that uh, right side uh, donor nephrectomy, they have to dissect uh, more deep and uh, there are a lot of complications. Uh, I know, but this is already known, that's what I asked. Yes. That is already known. Yes. Okay. I don't get it. Thanks. So.